A federal high court in Abuja has voided the February 7, 2023 list of delegates submitted to INEC by the APC in Kogi State for its forthcoming governorship primary election. Justice James Omotosho in a judgment held that there was no evidence before the court to show that valid special ward congresses were held from which the said delegates emerged. Justice Omotosho also noted that the party failed to provide credible evidence that INEC money the said Congress or Congresses from which the names on delegate list were derived. The judge who restrained INEC from accepting and acting on the delegates list said the APC in Kogi State still has an opportunity with the existing time frame to conduct valid special ward Congresses to elect delegates who will elect the party's candidate for the governorship election. The APC in Kogi State ought to have conducted special world congresses to elect delegates that will eventually elect the party's candidates for the governorship election, but none was conducted at all at any world. And it was based on that, that our clients approached the court to say, look, there was nothing but they just saw a purported list submitted and that the list should be set aside. And the court granted it and even warned that uh, the days of impunity, political impunity, are gone forever and it will not be tolerated and I advise the parties to go and conduct uh, congresses prior to the nomination of uh, their candidates. Today we are in court to, to strengthen democracy at the state level, to entrench uh, rule of law and internal democracy and, um, and uh, we, are, we thank God that the party has seen the, the fact of the case from our own ends and has given a judgment that is favorable to every party. And we appreciate all the members of the party at the state level and the leaders who supported us in the course of this uh, struggle. We are, our case is not against an individual or anybody, but is to, you know, is to fight for the right thing to be done within the party and avoid some of the you know, avoidable mistakes that cost us so much in other states such as Zamfara, River State, and of late even Nasarawa State. And, uh, and we also thank the leadership of the, of the party because the last time I met with the National Working Committee, presided over by the, by the National Chairman, uh, you know, I told him we discussed as to what can be done to bring justice to the parties in the state. And we said, no, the only thing to be done is to do direct primaries. And if you must continue with indirect primaries, then you must do delegate election, Congress, that will throw up legitimate uh, you know, Congress. And he assured me that he was going to ensure that we do direct primaries. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.